Aloha mai kaku kayalani ke ia and welcome to tutustarot.com. <clears throat> please like, share, and subscribe. Um, and please comment and let me know um, how it turns out in the month of February 2020. Today we are talking about the air signs Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, the air elements for February 2020. And we're doing love, money, and one question. So here we go. Let's start off with religious factors and this is religious factors here um when this card is pulled i am feeling um this has to do with uh the the couples okay so now the couples have been working really really hard um in the air elements they've been working really hard throughout the holidays and um up to 2020 they're still working really hard they're actually kind of um, needing a recharge of a spiritual battery so when I see this that's what that's what I'm, I'm understanding okay that's what I'm getting when I'm looking at this card here for the air elements okay so this is for couples so um, please observe in the month of February what's happening <clears throat> for the couples and um, as well as the um, love relationships that's happening for you okay please uh comment and let me know how it went for february 2020 and next up we have reconciliation and this is for the singles here someone from your past is returning to your life wow there's a lot of that going on um very interesting and you would know um what this card is talking about so let us know how it went um, but it's a, two beautiful cards for uh, the couples and for the singles out there okay don't give up singles your um, perfect mate is out there waiting for you yes thank you for stopping by and next we're going to pull the card for money and this is the mana card and the energy for money um, for the February 2020 is Haumea. And does everybody know who Haumea is? Haumea is the mama. She is the mother of Pele, the deity of the volcano. Yes, um, and our, the other siblings, yeah? Pele's other siblings. Now, when Haumea comes up, when we're talking about um, money, it's not really money this time. It's it's about you making the money. So you're going to make the money, but you're very tired and you're because you've been really spending it on both ends of the spectrum. Okay, you're very tired. You, um, so you need to recharge your batteries. Same like the religious factors here. Okay, because they're they're nearby and I'm associating it with um, you grounding yourself. So very simple, you know, you can ground yourself um, in the ocean washing yourself you can also ground yourself in the soil of the earth you can just put your um, bare feet on the grass and meditate and just kind of absorb Haumea's energy because that's why she's there for us okay wonderful okay now we have <clears throat> this card here it's a tarot card now it's a, for a question a yes or no answer so think of your question really really intensely okay got it all right, make sure it's clear so the spirit can understand. And let's flip the card. It's either a yes or no answer. Ah, you have a beautiful card here, the Four of Swords. Okay. Now, in um, the tarot, four, four of Swords is talking about, ha, huh, it's talking about rest, boredom, and much needed rest. Okay, so you can see this person here with the swords uh, above it and below it um the four swords is explaining that you know what you do need the rest and and from the cards prior to it it's yes it's a yes card yes to the information that's here and yes to the question that you asked i'm not sure what your question is but um might not always saying this is a yes answer because it's matching here with um the rest of the theme Okay, so this is for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. We thank you so much for stopping by at tutustarot.com. And until we meet again, ahui ho and malamopono.